All right, man. I'm gonna keep this man name anonymous. He uh he uh you know told me I should do this video. Now I spoke on this before. Um uh in a live stream, all right, and uh and a lot of people not gonna like this, but I'm just speaking facts. Now, Kareem Abdul Jabbar holds the, the most points in NBA history. Now, Kareem played from 1969 to 1989. All right. Uh, so he played to 22 to 41. That's almost 20 years of service. Let me call it right. At 21 years, 21 years he played in the league. And um, I want to show y'all something about this record. I know people are going to say, oh, man, it don't matter. And, and I brought this up on social media before. You got to understand, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar did this without making a three in his career. I think he made one. Well, they said he took none. We well, took one. It don't have it doesn't record the three. It just said he had 0.33% for three. So we're gonna assume he took a three or two. But let me see if we get the totals. So he had tipped it one point zero one in nineteen. In 19, his last season. He tipped a one in 87. So I'm really trying to get the totals. So he attempted a couple of them throughout his career. So uh, can we get the totals? So I can't get the totals, but he attempted it. Apparently, he attempted some. So here we go. He made one three-pointer his whole career out of 18 attempts. And if you notice, in the first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, the first half of his career, almost half of his career, the three-point line didn't exist. Check that out for a minute. The first half of this man's career, the three-point line didn't exist. So it didn't exist. So you got to understand that he did all this damage. You know, he scored all these points. He scored all these points without a three-point line. So think about that for a minute. Think about where that take you at. He did all these. He scored all these points without a three-pointer, bro. Think about that. He played a long time. Don't get it twisted. You know, and nobody said he was the GOAT for holding this record. It was just more he played a long time. And that's a testament to his genetics. That's a testament to taking care of his body. That's a testament to everything. He had, uh, what is that, 38,387 points. And we said, well, he made one three in his whole career. Attempted 18. It was one for 18 without a, with a three-pointer. You know what I'm saying? And then you go to LeBron James real quick. And there's no knock on LeBron. Brian. Throughout his career, he attempted 4.63s a game. Throughout his career. The totals, he made 2,201. He had tipped it 6, 6,393 threes. Think about that. He's, you know, 2,201 to 1 3. And Kareem Abdul Jabbar got all them points without shooting threes. Now, I got a whole live stream and I, and I pin it. I'm a pin it in the. I'm a pin it as the uh, as the late screen, as the end screen. I'm gonna make it the first little uh, 
around the minute mark, I'm gonna make it the first little tab in there. You'll see it. And back in the day, they were school averaging just as many points as they are now with tougher defenses and taking tools. They were. And to me, that to me, I know people in the, in the media are not gonna bring it up because it doesn't fit the LeBron narrative. It doesn't fit the narrative of uh, you know what I'm saying of uh, of uh, celebrating LeBron and getting as much media and fanfare. Uh, but come on, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar did this with one three. He didn't have a three-point line in the first 10 years. Now, could he have shot threes? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's something that nobody talking about. Now, I had somebody on social media tell me that, well, when Kareem was playing, he didn't have a three-second in the paint rule. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. That is 100% not true. That's not true. That's not true. And people say, well, he didn't play against, no, he played against Will fucking Chamberlain. He played against Will Chamberlain. And they introduced the three second rule uh, in 1936, was expressed such as no offensive player with or without the ball could remain in the key for more for three seconds or more. So, here I put this in there for people bring, bringing up lies on the internet trying to be funny. I put this right here, it's right here. My bad, not right here. It's right here. That's the, the defensive three second, it's right here. Right here. So yeah, I, I found I found that kind of funny. Somebody brought the you know Kareem and oh man, Kareem did that just shooting twos with one three. And like I said, it probably I won't I don't really want to go as far as saying this should be an asterisk like LeBron cheated or something like that. But that's something to look at. Kareem did all that just shooting twos. Like I said, you ain't gotta shoot threes to put up, you ain't gotta shoot threes. To win basketball games, to be effective, to score points, you don't have to. You don't have to at all. That's a misconception. It's a misconception. You know, it's a huge misconception. Huge misconception. Huge. You know, so it's kind of something to look at when 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 you're talking about when you talking about the you know when you're talking about this race is that you know don't 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 let it get lost in the sauce that you know you know Jared you know that uh LeBron James LeBron James and, you know, he's going to be the scoring leader. Ain't nothing that ain't nothing to doubt about it. But Kareem did this all shooting deuces and free throws. Think about that. He did all this shooting deuces and free throws. And I think that that need that needs to that needs to be said. And it seemed like he hating on Brian and all that type of stuff or whatever the situation may be, and, and it is what it is. I ain't the biggest fan of him getting on LeBron publicly and all that type of stuff and whatever the situation may be. Some of what he's saying, you know, is probably valid. But you could do that in private, bro. That's how I feel about it. But there's something to think about real quick. 
Might should be a small asterisk by by that. I wouldn't want to say an asterisk. That sound could too too strong. But Kareem Abdul Jabbar did it different. You know that, and then also don't forget that's pretty much a great era for big fellas. You had to have a big fella to to be in the mix. Don't forget that you had to have a big fella to be in the mix. Come on, you had to have a big fella to be in the mix. You know, you had to have that big fella to be in the mix back in the day. So, yeah, let me know what you girls and guys think. Check out the NBA Talk playlist. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. The subscribe button. It's the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase your chance to get notifications. We go live or drop a video. Financially, you want to support the channel. Cash up. Dollar sign. CJ Good 313. Memo CJ Good 313. PayPal link in the description. Hit the link tree. Find me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, Anchor, Cash App, Venmo, PayPal, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, the whole nine. My link tree is the first link in the description. Appreciate the love support. Let me know what you girls and guys think about the video. One time for the one time. Good fella TV. Peace.